Yes, about a dozen companies have said they're going to cut ties with the NRA. Um, a lot of them are uh, car rental companies that offer discounts, um, airlines that did uh, things like that. And I think what it shows is, you know, it's, it's they're private companies. They can they can break those ties if they want. Uh, other companies have decided that they're not going to jump into this this argument and and you know show exactly where they're standing on it. You see a lot of companies that are noticeably quiet. But these twelve have decided to, that this was a place where they wanted to take their company and. and make a stand in this way. Other companies are doing other things. Walmart, uh, Dix, L.L. Bean uh, have all said that they're not going to sell uh, assault, assault style rifles and some have said that they're not going to sell them to those under 21. Um, that, what comes of that, of course, also private companies, they can certainly do that and, and consumers can, can vote with their feet. Can you do it for 21? You set a day to 21? That's the, cha that's a day, the question. You know, say if you're not 21 because I think they can be challenged. Right, and I think that, that is what we're going to see. I think we're going to see a legal challenge to that, perhaps a 19 or 20 year old who says that, you know, you can't uh, deny me this if I'm allowed to do it under federal or state law, because then you're kind of getting into the Christian Baker situation. And does, does Dix get to decide who they serve and how if it's a state or federal law? So I think we're probably going to see some legal challenges, but it is interesting that private industry has decided to get into this argument.